Welcome to the Eaton Family Thunderdrome. It's the Muscle Car League. Meet 8, Season 8. Race 1, Lane 1, we have the defending grand champion. The Corvette Grand Sport Convertible. Running first in the competition, he is 26 points ahead of the El Camino. He has six wins and a second. He's, he's running high. Lane two, we have the 69 Dodge Daytona. He's fresh off his meet championship last week. Just two wins and two seconds thus far to add to his 53 career wins. Lane three, we have the 69 Dodge Charger. 24. Career wins, running fourth at the moment. Three wins this season, two seconds. He's going well. Lane four with a 57 Chevy Bel Air, fresh off his first win last meet. He's had four seconds, so it's finally about time he converted one into a win. And lane five, we have the CC9 Copo Camaro, running third, four wins this season and a second. Favorite for this race is the Grand Sport, but can the Daytona repeat his great effort last week? Let's see. <clears throat> the race is tight. Bel Air's everything ahead and four. Corvette's hit top gear. He's taken them. The Grand <clears throat> Champion wins again. Too easily for him. Race two. Between these five, we've got 44 career wins as opposed to the first race, which is 119. In lane one, we have a 67 Ford Mustang GT Coupe. Flew high in the Patriots League. Got uh, three seconds thus far this year. Desperately hoping for a win today. Lane 2 with the 72 Ford Gran Torino Sport. 29 career wins, we'll get into that magic 30 today. One win and one second this year has been a very slow year for him. He came last in his race in the last meet, so he's out of form. Lane 3 with the Ion Motors Thresher. Two career wins. Best he's done this year is a couple of fourths. Last five races, he's come dead last. Lane four with the 87 Buick Regal. Seven career wins. Nothing this year, though. A few thirds. And lane five, we have the returning 67 Chevy Camaro. Six career wins. Nothing in his return, just a couple of seconds. So, the Mustang. Between the Mustang and the Camaro. Or can the Torino pull something out? From his glory days. Good Camaro head to head. Torino's come out fast in lane two. Mustang's come up with a pretty side. Oh. Mustang has just pipped him. We'll double check that with a photo finish. And yes, it's the Mustang. He has beaten the Torino. Race three. And we've got a good race here. 53 career wins between these five. In lane one, we have the 69 Copo Corvette. 24 career wins, looking for 25 today. He's had one win and four seconds. So he's up there, just needs to convert some of those seconds. Lane two, we have the veteran 75 Corvette Stingray. 12 career wins, but can I get anything better than fourth this year? Oh, that's a shame if he can't get a win up get some more points he'll be going back to Patriots League lane three we have the 73 El Camino Ute three career wins one this season and two seconds so he's got another year but he just would like to do a little bit better lane four we have a GT Scorcher three career wins and has run dead last in every race this year woefully out of form in lane five, we're the race favorite. 
running second in the competition. 73 El Camino Ute. Four wins and three seconds. 11 career wins. Love to bring up the dozen today, and he probably will. Well, let's see. Black El Camino hits the flat first. He's taken off. Cobra Corvette's running second, but the El Camino Ute hit the retros. They weren't going to catch him. He is too quick. Experience drops right down for race four. With a total of 12 career wins between these five. In lane one, we have the 75 Corvette Stingray. Five career wins, the most experienced in this field. Two wins this year and, and a second. Lane two, we have the CCA Chevy Nova. One win this year and a second. Lane three, we have the 71 Ford Mustang Funny Car. One career win, but not this season. Second's the best he's done. If he doesn't come up with a few more points, he'll be back to Patriots League. Lane four, we have the CD7 Pontiac Firebird. Added to his two career wins, making it a third this year. He's had two seconds, so it's a pretty good return. He'll be setting up for next season. Get a bit more experience. I think it's set up for a good run next year. And lane five with the 70 Plymouth Superbird, the rookie. Two wins in a second. That's a pretty good start. Favorite for this race would have to be the Plymouth Superbird. Let's see if the Corvette Stingray can do anything. Superbird losing five. Firebird and Nova are coming up after him. The Firebird's actually passing. The Firebird has beaten the Superbird. A good win to the Firebird. Race five, and we have a more experienced field. 54 career wins between these five. In lane one, we have the fifth placed 71 Plymouth Roadrunner, Toby's Roadrunner. Eight career wins. Three this season. He is the race favorite. Lane two, we have the 84 Pontiac Firebird. Stars and Stripes struggling all year. Last meet, he ran second. That's a good sign. Let's see if he can improve on that today. In lane three, we have the 69 Chevy Camaro. All aflame. He's a veteran with 12 career wins, but can only come up with a second this year. In lane four, we have another veteran, 29 career wins, hoping for 30 today. It's the 1970 Ford Maverick Grabber. One win this year in two seconds. In lane five, we have the 68 Corvette Gas Monkey. Five career wins to this year, but it was in the beginning of the season. He hasn't done much since. Well, can anyone beat the Plymouth? Let's find out. Grabber and Corvette are nose to nose on the inside. Plymouth is coming up fast in lane one. But it's a wily old veteran, the Grabber. The Grabber wins. Wow, he hasn't been here for a while. This is an interesting final. Welcome to the championship race. Meet eight, season eight of the Muscle Car League. We have first and second. We have a first timer. He's made it in his second stint for the first time to a championship race. We've got a couple of old stages who were there at the beginning. Wow, this has got everything. In lane one, we have the Defending Grand Champion and Leader, Corvette Grand Sport Convertible. 29 championships, highly favoured to go 30 today. Four this year. If he makes it five, shut the gate, he'll retain that 
Grand Championship for sure. Lane 2, the 67 Ford Mustang GT Coupe. His first championship race. Took him two stints. He finally wins a race. Let's see how he goes. Lane 3, the second place 73 El Camino Ute. One championship this year. Four in total. Looking good. Lane 4 with the 67 Pontiac Firebird. He's made one championship race this season and he came second. That was meet 5. Can he improve on that? It's a pretty tough field. And lane 5, we have the 1970 Ford Maverick Grabber. Four championships to his name. Finally brought up his 30th win. Bit of experience between these five cars. 86 wins between them. Well, let's see. First for the second. Who's going to win? Let's find out. Good racing, those and those Mustangs are coming off pace though. Corvette's hit top gear, they're not going to catch him from there. Corvette, too quick, too fast. That's five championships, they're not going to beat him for the Grand Championship now.